Well, turning now to social media and its impact on kids, school districts across the country, well, they are suing the major social media companies, claiming they're responsible for a growing mental health crisis. Now, Seattle and Silicon Valley are just some of the districts joining in on the legal fight. This against Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, and YouTube. Those are the major ones claiming social media use is linked to increases in mental, emotional, and developmental behavioral disorders. I wouldn't be surprised that by the middle of the year or the end of the year, that school districts all over the country are filing similar lawsuits. We may also see lawsuits being filed by the U.S. Department of Education and the Department of Justice. Google, which owns YouTube, responded saying, we provide parents with the ability to set reminders, limit screen time, and block specific types of content. And Snap, which owns Snapchat, says it uses a human moderation to review user-generated content before it can reach a large audience, and said it works closely with leading mental health organizations. Critics of the lawsuit say it's up to parents to do a better job monitoring their kids' online behavior. All morning long, of course, we've been asking you if you think schools should ban social media about 98% of the folks who voted on our poll believe it should be. We will, of course, continue to follow the results throughout the morning. Mario.